Hi, this is Dr. Barron with High Point Spine and Joint Center. I'm a chiropractic physician in western Nebraska with clinics in Sydney and in Kimball. And I wanted to talk to you a little bit today about back pain during pregnancy. Back pain is a very common phenomenon during pregnancy. There's a lot of different biomechanical changes that are happening during pregnancy and as the baby grows there's a lot of changes in load distribution and so it can cause certain stresses on the lower back and on the pelvis which lead to back pain. And so I think it's easier if you understand how the uterus sits within the pelvis that you can then relate to how changes in load distribution during pregnancy can then affect the lower back and pelvis and create some back pain. The uterus sits right within the pelvic rim here. If you think of it like a big hot air balloon that is then tethered down within the pelvis. There's some ligaments in the back of the uterus which tether, which tether down into the sacroiliac joints in the back. And then there's also some ligaments in the front called your round ligaments which tether the front of the uterus down into the front of the pelvis. And you can see how if we have changing ligamentous tone as there's hormones like estrogen and progesterone and relaxin, they all affect the tone of these ligaments. Changing tone in those ligaments can create fixation, restriction, a lot of biomechanical changes in gait that all can lead to problematic changes within the pelvis, which create pain. But then when we get those biomechanical changes, because of how those posterior ligaments attach into the sacroiliac joint, we also get changes in, in how that, pel that uterus is tipped within the pelvis. And so sometimes we call that intrauterine constraint because we get fixation back here, which creates a tugging or a pulling on some of those tethers of the posterior uterus, which then often pull the front of the uterus and we get like this tipping effect. With that tipping effect then, we get some constraint or some compression during it within the uterus. And during later stages of pregnancy, that can affect how the baby's able to turn, especially when it's about time to give birth, how that baby can tip and go into a normal delivery position with it head down. Um, so a lot of times if a baby's in a breech position, we'll want to fully evaluate their pelvis and some of these ligaments. And our treatment is aimed at reducing fixations, um, reducing biomechanical problems within the pelvis, so that those ligaments can relax, so that we can re, um, reduce intrauterine constraint, and so that that baby can go head down, and so that the whole birthing process, the carrying of the baby and the delivery of the baby can be as, as pleasant as possible. We have a lot of different obstetricians in the area that refer their patients, their pregnant moms, who have back pain to us, and we're able to fully evaluate the mechanics of how the pelvis works, and try and give them specific treatment to try and reduce the amount of pain that they have. So I hope this video was helpful for you in understanding some of the changes that take place during pregnancy and how it affects back pain. If you have any questions, feel free to reach out to us in any way. Thanks.